what's up you guys welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel please don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below i think it's on this side and welcome if you're an old subscriber if you're a returning subscriber welcome thank you for coming back i have a child so i'm watching what he's doing there so if you see me looking this way it's because i'm keeping an eye on him <laughs> but anyway i want to say thank you guys for always commenting sending me your questions and as usual um if you have anything you would like me to talk about please don't forget to dm me on my instagram at winifred underscore harry um or you can comment down on this video of whatever questions you have and i will be happy and honored to answer your question and so now this leads me to my topic right so if you if you and i have a conversation in private on on my dm and instagram I'm not going to share your information. Um, I'm not going to be sharing the sub whatever the subject that we, we touched on. Only if I asked you if I can make a video of it and you agree and you say it's okay for me to make a video of it, then I will do a video of it. So I don't want you guys to think that every time someone asks me a question on Instagram, I'm hopping on YouTube, making a video, blah, blah, blah. No, that's not what it is. I always try to get permission. If you say okay to go ahead and do a video, I will make a topic around whatever we talked about, which your information would not be seen, would not be shown. No one is going to know who you are. So um, with that being said, thank you guys for all the questions that you've been sending me. And I love, love talking to you guys. And again, so before I also start this video, I also want to say I am not a an expert on turkey i am not an expert on turkish men i've only been with one turkish man my whole life so i'm going based on experience um and i'm going based on experience as human beings being with someone else it doesn't have to be someone from turkey so if you do have relationship advice and you want me to you know if you just need to talk to somebody about like your relationship struggles please go ahead and email um dm me on instagram at winifred underscore harry or feel free to leave it down below i feel like we can all share ideas the more we talk about things the more we can all learn from each other and that's one of the reasons why whenever i do this video is to inspire it's not to bash anyone or not to um, bring anybody down there was a lady in one of my video who said that i was biased on my reviews of turkey and turkish men because my husband was turkish and i said to her she left a comment on one of my videos saying that i was very biased and i said to her my job is not to bring the bad to light my job is to bring the good to light not to bring down anybody or any race or anything but anyway so this intro is getting super long but so this video is about our turkish men using you um so the conversation began with someone who asked who is in a long distance relationship with this turkish man and the man apparently is a lot older than she is and the man told her he likes her but he he's not he doesn't love her so she wanted to know what i think if long distance relationship could work and things like that if he was just using her is he like strict um she has never met his family out of the three years like he always promised to go see her but he never makes it there um, but she's been to Turkey to see him, but she had to stay in a hotel room um, while she was in Turkey. I don't know why I keep looking at the wall, but <laughs> I was just trying to like get my thoughts together. But she had to stay in a hotel room. And so I wanted to say this. If you guys want to, you know, chime in on this conversation conversation please go right ahead and leave your thoughts and your opinion hopefully she's watching hopefully she's going to take other people's advice other than the advice that you know she and i have you know talked about and so forth um so what i say is that everyone's relationship is different um i had a you know long distance relationship could work um, and it, it may not work. It just depends on who is in the relationship. I think if you're going to be in a relationship, 
there's a lot of things that comes into play in a relationship sometimes you have to listen you have to listen to what the person is saying so it's not all about what you feel yes i know as women we all we always tend to go with our emotions our feelings what we feel we like this guy we're ready to do anything and everything for this guy that's fine but at the same time a guy tells you what they want directly guys are very straightforward like if they if they like you if they're in love with you they will let you know like they don't beat around the bush as much if he is beating around the bush as much then you know that there's something up and so i'm not here to tell you to leave your significant other or to stay with your significant other that's not what i'm here for because with every story there's the truth there's your side, there's his side, and there's the truth, right? So whenever I get your side, I cannot make a decision on your side, and that's not my job to make a decision on anyone's relationship. That's your job. But if you're looking for an advice from me, I can tell you what I think and just hope that you know everything will work out for the best now what i think might not be right what you think might not be right the only way to actually know what a man thinks is to always ask and that's what i told the person who had this conversation with me and i told her i said i cannot give you the answer because one i don't know the guy two i don't know you as i don't know you and three i only get the conversation from your side so it's very hard for me to make a decision or to tell you because because I have I don't have that power to tell you what I think it's going on but based on the conversation that I was having with her it seemed to me that he didn't want to be in the relationship with her first of all he's like super old uh, and she's like super young she's like in her 20s like early 20s and he's in like late 30s um, so um, so I said, okay, I'm going to make a video of this if that was okay with her. And she said, sure. And I and I wanted everyone to like think about this. So the whole situation is this girl, she lives in a different country. And the Turkish guy lives in Turkey. He's older. He's at a stage where he should have been married with kids and with his own family. Because he's like close to 40. And she just entered 20s. And she has gone to see him once and he's always told her he was going to come see her but he never did and she went to Turkey to visit him but she ended up staying in a hotel she never met his family she never met any of his friend and they've been quote-unquote dating for three years and so and then I asked her did you have you guys ever said I love you or whatever and she always and he always told her I like you but I don't love you and so I told her I don't think the relationship was going to go anywhere that's just my opinion so don't crucify me I just feel like a relationship would never work and this is not just with a Turkish man like I just feel like a relationship would never work if the guy is actually telling you what he wants from the relationship and you're thinking otherwise because I think she wants more and she really cares about this guy which is normal but you don't want to also waste your time because you're very young so those were my opinion and those are some of my answers to her um, so I noticed that she wasn't so happy with my answers because she was hoping for more again I don't know this guy, I don't know this person, just because I'm dating a Turkish man doesn't mean I know every Turkish man and how all Turkish men think. Um, so with this video coming out, hopefully a lot of you will be able to give your insights, um, your expertise on this situation. Um, comment down below. If you want to um, DM me on Instagram, you can go right ahead as well and DM me. And, but it's something that I wanted to bring to light. So this is not just something that only happens between Turkish men. This happens all around the country, like everywhere in the world. Like guys, you know, some guys lead girls on and girls lead guys on. You know, we all do it within ourselves. Um, but I just felt very bad for, for this person because she's so young and she really cares about this person. Um, so, so now that brings me to 
me being married to a Turkish person. Do I think a long distance relationship would work? Um, it would work, but you have to know your partner. You have to know the kind of relationship that you're in. Uh, you have to know the kind of person you're with. Um, so just because he's Turkish doesn't mean he's perfect because nobody's perfect. And just because he's Turkish doesn't mean he's telling you the truth at all time. I don't know where I stopped because I was a little bit distracted. But anyway, so um, I really enjoy you guys' question. Um, and I'm here to help if you do need my help in any kind of, you know, Turkish related subject that you want me to touch on please let me know i just feel like this um this conversation was a little bit was a little bit um i don't know there's a word but i can't think about the word right now it was just it was like it was hard because i don't want to break her heart by telling her that listen i don't think he's into you but at the same time i don't want to tell her that he's into her while it clearly showed that he's not into her hopefully <laughs> i hope i'm wrong um but i just feel like after three years of dating somebody you've never met their family you've never met any of your friends and he never wants to introduce you because he claims his family are very traditional and granted her family also were very traditional and she cannot really speak to anybody in her family about the situation again I got an okay from her to talk about the situation. So, you guys, don't kill me. If you send me questions, and if you don't want me to make a video of it, that's totally fine. I'm still here to listen to you. Um, but if it's interesting, and if I do ask if I could use it, and if you do say okay, I will go right ahead and make a video, and I would not be disclosing any of your information, so just keep that in mind. And so, you guys let me know what you think about this whole situation. Are Turkish men deceiving? Oh, that's what the title is going to be. Are Turkish men deceiving? Are Turkish men using you? Um, so, yeah. So, do you think this guy is using this little girl? Or do you think it's actually love? Um, I don't want to say her age, just in case he's watching. Um, and I don't want to say his age either pretty sure by now they probably know <laughs> but anyway uh so that's it so again going back to what i stated before um i don't know too much about turkish men i just know that the ones that i know from here they have been very good to whoever they're dating most of the time um turkish men in turkey are a different breed <laughs> different kind of men i don't know them that well well i don't know them and I don't know their traits and personality types and stuff like that. And so, um, so yeah, I really don't know. But based on, like, just having a relationship in general, taking out countries out of it, based on just a human relationship, I just felt like that relationship was not was not going to be is not going to be successful. And I also told her that I I hope and I pray that I'm wrong because i really want her to be happy because she really seemed like she was really into the relationship i really want her to be happy but the truth is based on her story it doesn't seem the the relationship was only received one way which was only her side like she's the only one who wants the relationship and he's just there just you know just to have someone to talk to and stuff like that um and yeah no money is it no money is involved she's not sending him money he's not sending her money it's just like i guess they just he just liked her company and like someone to talk to him and stuff so you guys let me know what you think about the situation are turkish men deceiving or turkish men using those girls or turkish men really serious about relationships um so let me know what you think about this whole turkish man and um long distance relationship if it actually does work if the guy is in turkey and you're not in turkey um i don't know because my husband when i met him he was not in turkey he was actually here in the state um so i don't know how that would work to to be in a relationship with someone who's from out of state i'm sure it could work um again you just have to know the person and you just have to know yourself i think for us as women if there's any advice that i can give to you anyone here who's watching not just a woman anybody who's watching one advice that i can give to you is know what you want 
if you know what you want you know what you don't want then you when you meet somebody you can tell them what you want and if it's not what they want you don't you don't have to waste your time on that person you can go and meet the next person that wants the same thing as you and if the person if whatever it seems like you guys if it seems like you guys both want the same thing then communication is key you have to ask the person so do you want to go into this fully or always just you know playing around you have to be able to communicate with that person communication is big key if you don't communicate you don't know the answer and sometimes when you communicate with somebody you have to listen you have to listen you have to understand what the person is saying to you not just talking you gotta listen and take in whatever they tell you because this guy clearly is communicating with her and is telling her i like you but i don't love you and she's like what do you think about the future and he's like i don't see i cannot read i cannot see the future and it's like where <laughs> you can't see the future you can see tomorrow you can't tell if you want to be with you or no i'm just kidding but again just listen listen to what the person is telling you you always have to listen well that's it for this video i don't want to keep going on and rambling about this whole situation but you guys let me know what you think about the situation because i did tell her that i was going to put it up and see if anyone wants to comment their opinion on this if you're a turkish guy please even better to hear from you please comment down below what you think about the situation um yeah so let me let me know and please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already joined the family if you haven't already joined the family don't forget to join the family by subscribing down below and thank you so much and i will see you guys in my next video thanks for watching bye peace